Baghdad. And uh, there's not too many Jews left in Baghdad, apparently. But this is one of their songs. St. Joseph's Society one night, and he was asking him, how come they carry this statue? And there are no Jews carrying this statue. Aren't we all together in this? The very next year, a few weeks after Richie died, we were carrying the statue down Hanover Street to the place where the temple used to be here in uh, the North End. 
There were a bunch of Jews that did that in honor of Richie. There are only two Jews who are really very important to the North End's development. Richie was certainly the premier one, and Jimmy Monterano was the other one. Thank you, Jimmy, for remembering our friend Richie and doing such a beautiful job and your society, the St. Joseph Society, what they do to bring entertainment and fun and frivolity to this area. It was Richie's idea to get this involved. Now, I want you to also know that because of Richie Egbert, that there is a committee been formed to make a unity statue in front, of the Paul, in front of Paul Revere's house in the North End in the square. You'll see this develop. We'd like you all to participate in it wow. sometime. But we're going to have a beautiful park there in front of uh, Paul Revere's house, commemorating all the immigrants of different ethnicities that have come to this, this wonderful place that we call the North End. At this moment in time, though, I want to dedicate this evening and the Klezmer's, perform Klezmer's performance to Richie Egbert, who without his shining light and friendship to the St. Joseph Society and the North End, we wouldn't be here tonight or for the carrying of the statue uh, with all the Jews. I'd like to invite Richie's family up here if you can, just for quickly, Sharon, come up here. I have a presentation to make. By the way, Sunday at 1 o'clock, if you want to see us Jews make fool of ourselves again, you can come up and watch us carry the statue to the temple. Uh, Richie's son, Sharon, Richie's wife. St. Joseph Society says Shalom. And the Jewish community of Boston wish Richard Egbert Shalom. Not hello, not goodbye, but rather until we see you again. Thank you for all you left us, more so for all you taught us. We are all one, and your actions brought us to understand that. The fuse that you lit has brought us together in unity. Shalom, friend, shalom. And it's signed by some guy named Harvey Allen. And I really, really appreciate the work that St. Joseph has done and in honoring the chief and his family this evening. Now let's get on with the quiz Let's go! 